Welcome back to Let's Play Bonk's Revenge! We have one stage left to go to. Which means we get to fight that stupid captain again. Oh man, the helicopter thing again. Um... Boo! Come on, buddy. Take that! Oh, if you're not careful, you can get caught between these stupid things. Blah. Man, quit going so fast. Or two of them that go towards each other come together. Nice! Haha, wasn't expecting that second part. Always a pleasant surprise. No, 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 I don't want to get smashed. Actually... I do want to get smashed. Here, everyone, I shall show you what happens. Squish. And I become Crab Bonk. Crab Bonk is essentially utterly useless. You can't bonk. You can't break blocks. You can't even jump in the air and bonk down. All you can do is that. However, you can squeeze in here and get things. Glorious things! Now I have to go the rest of the level like this. Until I get hit anyway. When you get hit, you revert back to normal. And like this! Quit throwing tomahawks. That doesn't even make any sense. Oh, Grimmy. There we go. Roundabout way of getting on top of him there. See, now, if memory serves, I want to get smushed once more time. Let's go, crap bunk! Do not get hit by that. Whatever that is. Acid, I'm guessing. One more extra life for the road, and I have full life! Nifty! Yeah. No, do not want to get squished between gears. Do want to get hit by that, though. Revert back to normal. Don't take any damage. Very nice. Oh, another one. I hate these. Okay, one more. Go away! Go away, Bubble! I do not like thee! And I really want that meat. Is there any way I can get it? Meat! Aha! Coming through! Not fighting another one of you. And I can fight the boss while invincible! I think this is the only time you can actually get this far. Aw, he doesn't one-shot it. Now, if I am really lucky, I can get on top of his head. Come on, missiles. Come on, if I'm lucky, if I'm ever so lucky, I can kill him! Ha ha, success. That's what a bonk... Yeah, that's what meat and getting on top of them does for you. Now it's time for us to near the final boss. Showdown with the raptor dude again, which I honestly don't know his name. And I've discovered you have to stand in the middle to get him to chase after you. And you do not want to get hit by hands. Hands are grabby. From me! Aw, oh, I was hoping I'd get another hit in. Yeah. Finish him off! Aw, oh, another hit. No, 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 no. Beat him, though. 
However, that means it's time... ...to fight King Drool himself! He has all of the attacks of all the individual bosses we fought up until now. So the volcano attack of boss one. And you want to attack him. Essentially, you want to hit his crown. That's a little high, though, so just hit his brow, hit a little above his brow. But this attack is all but useless, because you can just stand down here and not get hit. Ow! If your timing is off, it hurts like a son of a gun! Take that, drool! I believe that was in the ice of... whatever her name was. The ballerina lady. Ah ha ha! I got him an extra hit. I think I hit him twice that time. Okay, where are you gonna hit me with this time? Missiles. Missiles are easy to dodge. Give me something harder. This is the final boss. Admittedly, for a last boss, this is pretty easy. It's still epic, but it's... It is kind of easy, though. As long as you know what you're doing, anyway. More missiles that I can dodge easily. And... Attack! Oops. Attack, bonk! Boss down! Haha! -ha. And I paused the game because I'm stopping the video here. Next time, everyone, we'll see the end of King Drool, the conclusion to the game, and the end credits. So until then, take care, and don't bonk anybody in real life because it hurts.